How's it going guys? It's me Sandwich. Welcome back to my Let's Play of Fire Emblem Warriors 3 months. So, last time we recorded the Ashen Demon and now we can finally kill this prologue. It's one of the prologues that we missed. Alright, I think we've done as much as we can today. Let's rest up and prepare for the next battle. Well, this is new. You're not usually the one suggesting we take time off. That's because there's been too much to do lately. I haven't had the chance to showcase my natural laziness. Come on, I don't think there's a lazy bone in your body. You really should take more time for yourself, Claude. I'll consider it. Your Majesty, an urgent message has arrived from Deirdre. Uh-oh. This can't be good. The city is being attacked by the Almyran Navy, and they're calling for any aid we can provide. What? Myra again. After the defeat they just suffered at the throat? No. It must be someone else. I agree. These are most likely pirates who have assumed their name. Either way, they've got to have a pretty sizable force if they can attack an entire city. We should send any units that are ready to mobilize. Who do we have? My army can't spare much at the moment. To be honest, we're always a bit undermanned. Still, we might be able to send a couple of folks. How about me and Judith? You? But you're the leader of the entire army. Well aware of that, thanks. But as luck would have it, we've got a bit of time before our next battle. Besides, Judith and I know the terrain, which means we've got the best chance at ending things quickly. Going back to Deirdre will be a stroll in the park for the two of us. Still, I wouldn't say no to a seasoned mercenary tagging along. Eh? 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 I'm not sure I follow. Really? Because I was laying it on pretty thick. Look, it's you, okay? I want you. And here I was looking forward to a little time off. Well, seeing as the king himself is making the time, how about you buck up and do the same? Yes, ma'am. Uh, of course, ma'am. <laughs> Glad that's settled. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, if, if you don't regret the action demon, you, you won't get a chance to play it from a lot. Oh, just healing me. Hmm. Yep, those are pirates, all right. And they sure made a mess of the place. Time to sweep it clean. Let's try this. Let's. No problem, I got it. Come on and hand over all your values. You don't fancy getting dragged back to Almira, that is. Take a breather. Not a problem. Up there. Still keeping up the No act. problem, I got it. What if a real Almira What these sea dogs lack in skill, they make up for in sheer numbers. If we're not careful, they can easily overwhelm us. My turn. Bring it down! This is always half time to build stuff for me. Hit them hard and not a problem. Let's try this. Let's back. Folks are clearly as scared of all myrans as ever. Otherwise, intimidation tactics like these would never work. A sad truth for most, I think. Why, until I met Dear. I thought all Almyrans were savage, bloodthirsty beasts. These pirates aren't so tough once you get them on shore. Still, I bet there's more where that came from. Not a problem. Take a breather. Let's try this. Let's see. More of them, is it? Let's knuckle. Down and put them in there. Not a problem. Place. Are you changing places? Take your final bow. Now leave. Let's try this. 
Let's pirates are raiding the harbor storehouse and plundering the goods inside. Well, that sounds bad for business. We better get across the bridge and put a stop to it. Not a problem. How am I supposed to cross? I can't even do anything. I can't even go anywhere. Actually, I need to walk in here. Let's try this. I can fight here. This. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Let's go to the bridge. Let's go to the bridge. One of us will stay here and the other one will go here. I've got this. Let's try this. Let's go. No problem. I got it. Bring it down. It's just about all the pirates in the city. Let's head for the harbor storehouse. Take a breather. You know, if Fodlin just looked... Not a problem. Outward a little more. Our opinion of Almira might change for the better. Easy, Your Majesty. Yeah. I know your friend with Nadea. Not a problem. That doesn't mean we should start siding with his people. Good ass shaft fly. Just outside the city. Then let's My deal turn. with them and finish this. All units, move out. certainly got nothing on you. Feel free to relieve as many as you like of their duties. Uh oh That one's an Almiron for true. And not just any Almiron. I'm the one and only, the dare, the undefeated. Well, he's certainly enjoying himself. I'd better dig deep or he's going to steal all the fun. Let's try this. Let's see how this goes. Not a problem. Bye. 
Well, couldn't hurt. Scott, take I'm a breather. unstoppable. Nice one. That takes care of the pirate invasion. A bit more trouble than I expected, but we got through it all right. fine if we could have brought a few more soldiers along. I don't know, kiddo. You're good at the whole confidence side of things, but not so hot when it comes to actually sealing the deal. A man who calls himself Nadair the Undefeated says I'm overconfident? That's rich. Ugh, cut it out, you two. This friendly banter is going to make me sick if you keep it up. You clearly know each other better than you're letting on. Say, kiddo, maybe now's the time to... You know. Ah, right. Actually, Judith, this is probably a good opportunity for me to come clean about something. I'm waiting. My mother is in Elmira, and has been for the last 20 years. Lady Tiana? Huh. Well, that's a bit unexpected, but not altogether surprising. That's where I was born, Elmira. And my father, he's the king. Wait. So that makes you... An Almiran prince? I am. Sorry I didn't tell you before. Well, this certainly isn't something I expected to hear today. Still, I imagine it's not easy to bring up. So what's your deal? You don't seem surprised by this at all. Yeah, I never heard any of it directly from Claude, but I thought as much. I figured it out right around the time we fought Shahid. Oh, right. 
So that would have made him your brother. Yeah, he said that earlier. Different mothers, but yeah, he was my older brother. I didn't want to fight him. I that brother's really technically that. But, well, for the sake of both Fodlin and Almira, he had to be dealt with. Your brother thought he was doing right by Almira in his own way. There's always been unrest in the royal family. Everyone fighting over the right of succession. But that man would have been a terrible king. His lust for power just consumed him. So does this mean my little Claude is going to return to Almira and seize the throne one day? I don't know. For right now, I'm more concerned about my duties as king of the Federation. Eventually, I plan to tell everyone about where I came from. But for now, keep it to yourself. I don't want to make things more complicated than they need to be. I won't tell a soul so long as you answer me one question. Have you ever sought to deceive us? Either as the leader of the Alliance or as king? Never. Lester and Fodlin are my home, and I intend to fight for everyone who lives here. So, do you trust me? I do, little Claude, or your majesty, I should say. Just don't let me down. I won't, Judith. And thanks. And that pretty much does it. And I'm not, I'm not doing these because I read them before. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. So, and I'll be covering the either the last part of the log, or I could do the rest of the stuff I still need to do, or something. I don't know. But thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next episode. So until next, until next time, catch you later.